going to start by taking your measurements. I like to use cardigan I already own. Measure from the front, all the way around the neck, and back down the front. We'll call this A, minus 65 centimetres. Then measure across the shoulders. We'll call this B, minus 32 centimetres. Lastly, measure across the shoulders to the bottom of the cardigan. This is C, minus 70 centimetres. Now that you have your measurements, you need to work out your gauge. You do this by knitting a 10 centimetre squared with the yarn that you're going to use, and then divide that all by 10, so you get how many stitches and rows you need to do to make one centimetre squared. So this is made up of basically two squares, so we need to find the measurements for each square. We'll start by working out A, which is 165 times 1.9 rows, which is 313.5 rows. We'll round that up to 314 rows. We'll work out C the same way, which is 70 times 1.9, which equals 133 rows. And finally, we will work out B, which is 32 times 1.4, which is 144.8. We'll do 45 stitches. The past measurement will very much depend on how baggy you like your sweaters. It can be anything from 45 to 23 stitches. I like mine quite baggy, so I did mine 45.
Now we are ready to assemble. Lay out your pieces like so, find the center points, then stitch them together. Then match up these four points, green to green and blue to blue. Remember when sewing these seams up to leave a hole for your arms. You may want to try it on sporadically as you stitch these seams. Mm -hmm. 